let's take one more problem on Millet Thompson method. If u is equal to e to the power x into x cos y minus y sin y is the real part of an analytic function f set, an analytic function f set, find f set and the image the report v. That is the question. Now u is given, so when u is given, you know the formula. The formula is f dash set is equal to other when u is given. The formula is f dash set is equal to ux minus i into uy. From u, you are finding ux. From u, you are finding uy. uy. Now substitute x is equal to z, y is equal to 0. Integrate problem is finished. Now let us take u. What is u? u is equal to this much e to the power x into x cos y minus y sin y. ux, ux means you are partially differentiating with respect to x. Now this is first function, e to the power x is first function, x cos y minus y sin y, that becomes the second function, uv root. Now first function, e to the power x into, differentiation of the second part, how? With respect to x, that is dou by dou x of x cos y minus y sin y, plus second function x cos y minus y sin y, I have written that, into differentiation of e to the power x, e to the power x one thing. So ux is equal to e to the power x, write that as it is. Now, with respect to x, I am differentiating this. Cos, with respect to x, with respect to x here, cos y is constant, take it outside, differentiation of x, 1. Remember, with respect to which variable you are differentiating, I am differentiating with respect to x, with respect to x, y, sin y, both are constant, so therefore differentiation of that is 0. Next, x cos y minus y sin y, as it is I have written, e to the power x, as it is, it is there. Now here, substitute x is equal to, wherever in this expression, in this expression, wherever x is, wherever x is there, put x is equal to z, wherever y is there, you are substituting y is equal to 0. So, put x is equal to z, e to the power z, put x is equal to z, it is e to the power z into, right. Now, put y is equal to 0, cos 0, what is the value of cos 0? 1. This 0 is there, so therefore 0 plus 1, 1. What's that? You are getting a point. When you put x is equal to z, e to the power z, put y is equal to 0, cos 0, what is cos 0? 1. Next, coming to this, put x is equal to z here, z, right? Put y is equal to 0, cos 0, what is cos 0? 1, right? Put x is equal to z, z. Put y is equal to 0, cos 0, that is 1, minus, Put y is equal to 0. When you put y is equal to 0, you are getting 0. 0 into sin y is 0. Into. Put x is equal to z. e to the power z. This is what I am got. So ux is equal to e to the power z plus z into e to the power z. This is what I got. Now let us from u, from this u, let us find u y. Now with respect to y, with respect to y, if I want to differentiate, take out the constant. With respect to y, e to the power x is constant, take it outside. So this e to the power x is taken outside. It is a constant, I have taken it. Now, I have to differentiate x cos y minus y sin y. I repeat, with respect to y, I have to differentiate. With respect to y, e to the power x is constant, take it outside. So, I have taken that e to the power x outside. When you take e to the power x outside, what is remaining? x cos y minus y sin y. This should be differentiated with respect to y. So, with respect to y, dou by dou y of x cos y minus y sin y. I have written that as it is. Right? Now, so therefore, this is equal to e to the power x. Write it as it is. With respect to y. With with respect to y. Uh, so therefore, let us operate. De separate it. Dou by dou y of x cos y. I have written. Dou by dou y of x cos y. Right? Next, minus dou by dou y of y sin y. So, u y is equal to e to the power x as it is x. It is a constant. Take it outside. With respect to y, you have to differentiate cos y. That is minus sin y. Now, with respect to y, y sin y, product rule I have to use. First function, y into differentiation of sin y, cos y, plus second function, sin y into di, that I have written, differentiation of y, 1. Once again, I repeat. See, observe, dou by dou y of x cos y, written dou by dou y of y sin y, I have written. With respect to y, x is constant, take this x outside, here. 
cos y differentiation minus sin we are coming to this product rule because you have y here you have also y here so product rule y into differentiation of sin y cos y plus second function sin y into difference plus second function sin y into differentiation of y one so this is what we got uy now substitute x is equal to z y is equal to zero here also if i put x is equal to z e to the power z put y is equal to zero sin zero what is the value of sin zero zero so zero into x zero put y is equal to zero 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 into cos y zero put y is equal to zero sin zero sin zero so what do you got u y is equal to e to the power z into zero therefore zero now let us substitute here what is substituting f dash z is equal to u x minus here same thing same thing i have written here f dash z is equal to right u x minus i u y now what is my u x here the result you got u x is equal to this result i am writing d to the power z plus z into d to the power z right minus i into u y what is u y u y is zero so take e to the power z as common factor if i take e to the power z as common factor e to the power z into behind e to the power z 1 i have written behind e to the power z z if you take e to the power z as common factor 1 remains i have written that if you take e to the power z as common factor z remains i have written that so f dash z is e to the power z into z plus 1 right now to find f of z what you have to do you have to do integration how do you integrate either by parts or by bernoulli's rule what is that now take this as first function z plus 1 why because on differentiation it becomes zero e to the power z s second function observe here take this as first function this is second function so first function z plus 1 into difference integration integration of second e to the power z just remember this much what you are remembering here first into integral of second if you remember that is enough first z plus 1 integral of second integral of second means integral of e to the power z e to the power z only next thing is what i say is differentiate the first term integrate the second term differentiation of z 1 differentiation of 1 0 integrate second bracket integral of e to the power z e to the power z again differentiate 1 0 so therefore i am not considering the next term i am not considering so what you got this much only f of z simplify you will get z e to the power z plus c so what you got is f z is equal to z into e to the power z plus c so that is what i am required to find f z now to find v to find so what is f z f z is equal to z into e to the power z plus c this is what you got if you want to find v Put f z is equal to u plus i v. Put z is equal to x plus i y. Here also you put z is equal to x plus i y. You will get e to the power x plus i y. That you can write that as e to the power x into e to the power i y. That e to the power i y is written as cos y plus i sin y. Multiply, separate the real and imaginary part. Take the imaginary part. That.